stone fruits such as peaches, apricots, plums and nectarines has enabled Tunisia to earn much needed forex income from their production. This year, the Agriculture Department and the Interprofessional Fruit Grouping in Tunisia estimate the production of peaches and nectarines will rise to 156,000 tons compared to 152,000 tons last year. Apricots production will reach 37,400 tons, while that of plums will amount to 20,100 tons, up 8.7% compared to 2021. As for almonds, the production will reach 70,000 tons, an increase by 5.8%. Good climatic conditions this season have favored a good production of stone fruits and an increase in quantity by 3.5% and also in quality. Winter and spring were characterized by cold weather and it's raining at the right moment. Fruit production was up in 2021, but it's even better in 2022. The Interprofessional Fruit Grouping is calling for the improvement and optimization of transport and logistics in order to boost the export of fruits to foreign markets. The Interprofessional Fruit Grouping organizes several events locally and abroad to promote fruit exports. We are always evaluating and improving our strategy and the quality of Tunisian fruits produced by local farmers. The only problem is related to transport and logistics. This is the main handicap for improving fruit exports. According to the head of the Tunisian Union of Agriculture and Fisheries in the central region of Qirwan, fruit production and distribution industry faces several challenges in the North African country. Agricultural products and equipment are very expensive. Prices have tripled in one year. The cost of fruit production has skyrocketed. Farm labor costs continue to rise while labor shortage is noticeable. Meanwhile, the purchasing power of Tunisian consumers has deteriorated. Libya is the main export market for seasonal fruits, with around 80 to 90 percent of exports followed by Europe and Gulf countries. Tunisian farmers and regional interprofessional fruit groupings are urging the agriculture and trade departments to promote fruit export operations this season. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.